WTFNN. Headline news update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 2 p.m. Eastern time on Thursday, two hours left to go in the trading day. And we got markets pulling back to a little bit of negative territory so far. S&P is negative by about seven points, trading at 3,088. We get the Dow Jones negative by 60 points, trading at 27,722 right now. NASDAQ negative by 17 points, trading at 84.65. Gold contract catching a little bit of a bid, up about $10 at 14.73. We've got silver up 12 cents at 17.03. Notes and bonds, we're getting some higher price and lower yield. The 10 year up 15 ticks, 129.12. The 30 year up a full point and four ticks at 158.24. And the dollar index with a little bit of weakness, dollar off 247 ticks, trading at 98, 127. We'll start things off this morning, this morning, this afternoon. We're going to start it off with the VIX as we get a little bit of negative action in the markets. VIX with a little bit of a spike, reaching 1380 at about just prior to noon Eastern time. Right now, the VIX trading 1339. Some of the movers out there today to jump around, you had Walmart out with their earnings last night. Quite a spike to higher price earlier, but talk about pulling back. Walmart, just at 7 a.m. this morning, was up there at 125.69. You just traded to under 120 today. Walmart now negative for the day after a beat. They guided up on their forecast. Nonetheless, Walmart negative for the day. How is that hitting Target? Target, on the flip side, getting a boost from what Walmart had to say. Target up 1.76%. Jumping over to the cannabis sector, canopy growth disappointing the market last night. Talk about an extension of losses. Canopy down 15%. They missed on revenue estimates. They missed on earnings as well. And to put things in context, folks, cannabis might be around for the long haul, but talk about a pullback. $59.25 about a year ago in October of, ninth, of, excuse me, of 2018. Canopy now trading 1564. And one of the other movers that we have out there going on, as it loaded, we got our crude oil chart, got the EIA inventories at 11 o'clock. You have crude trading from $57.60, now almost a dollar below that level with crude, December crude trading at $56.73. Stay tuned, folks. We're going to man Dave White coming up live with the Power Trading Hour from 2 till 3. Tom O'Brien live from 3 till 4. Markets in negative territory. 10-year yield trading to lower yield. We'll be right back, folks.